Welcome to KTN Sports. Now, after not impressing, it's always supporting fans during the 2014 Kenya Premier League season. AFC Leopards sacked their Dutchman manager, Peter de Jong, in what the club has termed as a step to reviving the Leopards' den. But as Moses Wahis now reports, Ingwe players know it, uh, knows it all too well what it means to go th without pay for a period of three months. After it has not been all merry and the best, or rather a happy new year at the AFC Leopards Den. After former AFC Leopards coach Peter De Jong was fired by his employers during a temperamental special general meeting, that being barely eight months into his one and a half year contract, the club secretary general George Aladwa hold it firm that the decision is best for the club. Yeah, De Jong was good, uh, was a good coach, but you see when we were a good coach and we were not uh, giving out the good results, then you have to go. When you contract a coach, it's his duty to make sure he gets the results for the fans. So it's not our fault. It's about results and performance. The Dutchman guided Ingwe to a seventh finish in the 16th table on 41 points, 19 shy of champions Gormahia. His sacking follows that of his deputy Juma Abdallah and goalkeeping trainer Washington Muhanji. In that period, however, according to the club secretary general, their house was never in order. There was a very big mix-up. Uh, in playing unit uh, of FC Leopards and the coach because he came mid-season and that one uh, did go well with our players and with the technical bench. The club has however settled to another coach that is yet to be officially announced. And we'll, we'll be unveiling him very soon but for now I cannot give you the name but we have a new coach. That one I can confirm. And in another club's huddle the AFC Leopards have not paid its players for three months out of the Kenya Revenue Authority froze their accounts due to tax arrears, an issue that is however being resolved. It's not about uh, the salary is not there, the salary is there and this is uh, a process whereby you have to follow because it's not a, a neck uh, process, it's a government process. Termed as one of the biggest clubs in the country, one will wonder whether AFC Leopards den is broke. Yeah. No, 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 you're not broke. You see, we have a sponsor. And our sponsor is Mumias. And we thank the sponsor because last year they knew they, they gave us three years sponsorship. That's ending in uh, 2016. With the KPL and GoTV trophies such topping their 2015 agenda, the Leopards are expected to make five more signings in a quest to redeem themselves. Moses Wahisi, KTN Sports.